Besides being one of the most famous CEO in the world, Sundar Pichai is a great entrepreneur. But have you ever wondered how the famous star lives? In this video, you will learn all about the net worth of Sundar Pichai. Career Sundar Pichai born on 1972 in Madurai, starting his career as a materials engineer, Pichai did engineering and product management at the Silicon Valley Corporation Applied Materials. Following that, he worked in management consulting at the firm McKinsey & Company. Net Worth The estimated net worth of Sundar Pichai is $1.31 billion in 2022. Sundar Pichai net worth grows every year. Google is the most sought-after application, which gives instant results within a fraction of seconds. Also, it shows how much of a second the results have been obtained. In today's scenario, before we take expert advice, we first look at what Google has to say about it. The greatest fact about Google is that there are tons of solutions available for each and everything. Google Holdings in April 2013 Sundar was granted 353,939 restricted shares of Alphabet stock that had a five-year vesting period. When those shares fully vested in April 2018, they had a paper value of $380 million. They had been worth as much as $450 million when the stock was trading at nearly $1,300 per share. At the time he was awarded the grant, the shares were worth $184 million. In addition to his 2013 stock grant, Sundar has earned north of $100 million in total compensation every year from 2014 onward. As we mentioned previously, he earned $199 million in 2016. On December 20, 2019, it was announced that Sundar would receive an additional grant of $240 million in stock options over three years. Furthermore, his base salary was raised to $2 million up from $650,000. Google In 2004, Pichai joined Google. For the company, Pichai led the development of numerous major software products such as Google Chrome, Google Drive, Chrome OS, and Android. He also oversaw the development of applications including Google Maps and Gmail. In 2010, Pichai introduced a new audiovisual media format called WEVM. In the summer of 2015, Pichai was chosen as the new CEO of Google. He officially took over the position that October following the creation of Alphabet, Google's new holding company. In late 2019, Pichai also became the CEO of Alphabet. Car Collection Mr. Pichai has a good collection of luxury cars in the world. His car brands include Porsche, BMW, Range Rover, and Mercedes-Benz. Privacy During his tenure as CEO of Google, Pichai has attracted controversy for a variety of reasons. First, in 2017, he was publicly questioned for firing an employee who denounced Google's diversity policies in a 10-page manifesto. In December of the following year, Pichai faced greater controversy when he was questioned by the United States House Judiciary Committee on a myriad of issues related to Google. Specifically, he was asked to give testimony relating to the company's privacy practices and potential political bias on its platforms. In response to the privacy issue, Pichai asserted that Google users may elect to opt out of having their data collected. In July 2020, Sundar, Jeff Bezos, Mark Zuckerberg and Tim Cook were called to testify before the United States House of Representatives Subcommittee on Antitrust. Sundar fielded the very first question of the day. That question, asked by Rep. David Cicilline. In late 2020, Pichai and the CEOs of Twitter and Facebook were subpoenaed by the United States Senate Committee on Commerce, Science, and Transportation. They were asked to testify before the committee in relation to concerns over the tech industry's exemption from Section 230 of the Communications Decency Act of 1934. Honors Pichai has been the recipient of some significant honors. In both 2016 and 2020, he was named on Time's list of the world's 100 most influential people. Among his other accolades, Pichai was bestowed with the Padma Bhushan in 2022, granted by the government of India, the honor is the third highest civilian award in the country. This was the net worth of Sundar Pichai. Who do you want to see next time? Let us know in the comments.